Welcome to another episode of Let's Talk Travel. My name's Pat Hand, and we are glad that you're here. Uh, welcome to our live listeners. And if you're catching us on one of the instant replays, we are definitely glad that you are here as well. Tonight, I am doing another episode of Pat's Picks. These are some deals that I've come across, some opportunities, let's say, uh, that I just think are great opportunities or uh, great value, sometimes both rolled into one. And uh, these are travel opportunities for 2024. And folks, now here we are, we're approaching. I mean, can you even believe that we are here in the last a uh, few days of August when I'm recording this in 2023, we're going to be past the end of the year and you're going to be looking to book a 2024 vacation before you even know it. So I'm going to talk about some opportunities for next year and, and see where uh, any of your interests might lie, if any of these might ring your bell. I am going to start this evening with an opportunity for Alaska. Now, folks, if you have not ever been to Alaska, I just kind of wonder why. Uh, it is such an amazing, awesome destination. And uh, we do it by land with, with railroad and self-drive. We do it by cruise and cruise tour. However you do Alaska, it does not disappoint. Um, I came across, I was researching a trip for a client, and I came across this particular cruise. For, this is a round trip out of Seattle, seven nights for next May, departing May 15th, Seattle. And this uh, sails out of Vancouver, and uh, it's on the Holland America's Zandam. Now, what do I love about Holland America? They have a very civilized, uh, upscale cruise product. That it's it's premium. With it's not stuffy, but it caters, frankly, to to the more mature audience for the most part. You see a few families on board, but but it's uh, mostly empty nesters that you find on board the Holland America products. They have beautiful mid-sized ships. They're not huge ships. They're not the mega ships. There's not going to be any climbing walls or belly flop contests on board any of the Holland America sailings. What you will find is great music, great food, good solid entertainment, and lovely destination-centric itineraries. Now, this particular sailing is on the Zandam, and that's one of their smaller ships. So it has a very intimate feel, and it will take you uh, through Tracy Arm, which is uh, just kind of a, a, a sea day, and calls on. It's a very, it's a just really a classic itinerary, calling on Juno, Skagway, <clears throat> Glacier Bay, Ketchikan. Um, and then back to Vancouver. We did a similar itinerary. And folks, you want to make sure when you do Alaska, you want to make sure uh, to try to do Glacier Bay. If you're doing one of the seven night cruises, uh, Glacier Bay is just such a quintessential uh, place to go in Alaska. Uh, it just took my breath away. I think even more this, the last time we went this spring, um, and we sailed about the same time uh, just this year. And it was a tremendous experience. We loved it. Very similar itinerary to this one. And um, this one actually came in. And I, I've actually priced out because it's such a good deal. I've actually priced out an AAS suite. That's a suite category. Uh, so you have more room with a veranda. Uh, this includes your beverage package, um, a night or two of premium dining at one of their, and their dining is fabulous on these, these premium restaurants. Well worth that. And uh, also some shore excursion credit on this package, as well as your fare, fees, taxes, 
total for two people with all of this came in at just over six thousand six thousand eighteen dollars and again folks that is for a sweet category a veranda suite category on board the holland america uh zandam lovely lovely ships um and, and if you're an empty nester and you love music uh you love uh destination centric uh, type itineraries and great service and food. This would be a great choice for you. Um, and again, that's for May 15th, that particular sailing. Now, one of the other things that I have come across that I love now, folks, I just love Colette Tours. They have some just delightful tours. And did you know, folks, that if you book with Colette, and you live within 50 miles of your departure airport, that they will pick you up with a private car and driver and take you to the airport even? Isn't that a great perk? Well, I, I have chosen a couple of Colette itineraries to uh, focus on. They have a particular type of tour that I think is just a lovely concept. It's called a spotlight. And with these particular tours, you're not uh, checking in and out of hotels every couple of days, schlepping your luggage around and, and going from one place to another. These, th these particular tours put you in a particular city and you get an in-depth exposure. You check into one hotel, you stay there, and you take day trips to explore that area. So you're getting an in-depth exploration of that particular destination. And I love this concept. If you would uh, enjoy the idea of a spotlight sort of tour like that, uh, I love the spotlight on London. Um, this it's just, you, you can just immerse yourself in, in London and in the rich history and the culture. See Trafalgar Square, Big Ben, Buckingham Palace, Westminster Abbey, all of those wonderful, wonderful uh, tours that you, that, um, I, uh, uh, that places that you just want to see. There, You just do not want to miss any of those high points when you go to London. Uh, you're going to, to ride the tube on some of these. Uh, and you'll get to choose between whether you want to do see a performance at the London Theatre or Afternoon Tea, uh, Tower of London, uh, route, Cruise the River Thames. Um, you're just going to see the city from a different perspective on this. Uh, you're going to include th this particular tour includes uh, eight meals. You'll have two options for choices. Um, just again, you're going to have Buckingham Palace. Uh, you're going to uh, have an, a, a culinary tour of London's East End. How cool is that? You're going to get to ride the underground uh, and, and you get to choose between the London Theatre or whether you want to have high, high tea. Here you have eight meals, five at breakfast, a lunch, two dinners, all of this included. Uh, they have, do have a couple of optional excursions for you to uh, that you might want to choose from. Uh, they they're around sixty five dollars for for and there's only a couple of them. So basically, this tour starts. Can you believe this, folks? Double occupancy, so two people sharing. Just nineteen ninety nine per person is what it starts. Um, what a fabulous deal! that is for all that I've talked about here. Uh, and uh, if you're a solo traveler, tour like this is a great place to plug in for you solo travelers. And uh, you know, that single supplement that just kills you with a lot of trips, only $600 on this particular tour. I love that spotlight tour. If you like that concept of a spotlight tour where you're plugged in in one destination and getting to do an in-depth uh, exploration of that, do, do your sightseeing from one hotel without having to, to be moving every couple of days, uh, how about a spotlight on Tuscany? Folks, 
Italy is just such a wonderful destination. Everyone who goes to Italy literally comes back in love. And Tuscany is pretty much the high point for most people of their, their Italy trip. There is so much history, so much uh, wonderful, <coughs> I'm sorry, so many wonderful things to see that you can do there. Um, you're going to, to uh, have just several different things, including a winery tour, uh, 10 meals, seven breakfasts, three dinners. Uh, this is a nine-day tour, folks, <coughs> with all of those things. Just think about the rolling hills of Tuscany and the, the, the vineyards. You're going to get that wine tour out into there. Uh, the medieval villages up in Tuscany. Um, you're going to have a famous resort. You're going to be up there staying at the Montecatini Terme, which is a famous resort and spa town. Uh, you'll, you'll visit Pisa, Florence, and San Gimignano uh, in the Italian countryside. I mean, just so much to see. The charming town of Lucca. Uh, that is a place, actually, somebody told me just this week that if you haven't been there, that needs to be, on, and I haven't, it needs to be on your bucket list. They said it was just the most charming town that they had ever visited. But there's just so much to see on this one. Again, nine, nine days on this tour. Would you believe that pricing on this one also starts at $19.99. Now, it's going to vary on these tours. What dates? The more popular uh, dates in midsummer are going to be more than the early and late season dates. But but uh, lots of different dates available for these tours. So contact us to, to check on what might be available for your preferred dates and what the pricing might be. So $19.99 double occupancy starting on this uh, tour for nine days. And the solo supplement for you single travelers, again, it's just nine or five hundred dollars on this tour. If you're traveling alone and and uh, want to plug into this particular tour, now I have you know, Dancing Moon Travel. We are big on cruises, and so I can't help but tell you about. A couple of cruise specials. I came across this one just yesterday as I was uh, researching uh, some options for a client and, and trying to find a particular tour. This is a very interesting itinerary to me. Uh, it actually, it's, it's a celebrity cruise. Love celebrity. If you're not familiar with them, they're another premium line. They're, they're taglined modern luxury, and that just about tells you everything you need to know. The ship's are uh, have a sophisticated kind of upscale flair, uh, not at all stuffy. Great entertainment. They're known for their for their food. Their culinary uh, offerings are are just terrific on celebrity, and we have always just loved the cruise experience. Great entertainment and uh, focus on client service. Love the dining rooms, and um, I've had a couple of really really good. Uh, memorable meals at some of, of their premium restaurants, the four fee extra restaurants. You do, if you sail celebrity, you really should try a couple of those restaurants, work them into your budget. But uh, this, this is the celebrity uh, package and it is just such a great itinerary. Tampa, uh, this this actually sails April 3rd of 2025. So we're looking way ahead here. This is for 2025. So if you need to, to plan your budget, this would be a great choice for you. Uh, sailing April 3rd of 2025 is available to book now. So plenty of time to, to get your $500 deposit down and make interim payments along if that works better for you. But uh, you're on the Celebrity Constellation out of Tampa. Uh, Constellation is just a favorite of so many people. They love that. It's kind of a mid-sized ship, and, and uh, it just has a lot of character. Uh, and the itinerary on this one calls on New Orleans, 
you're actually there for uh, over 12 hours in New Orleans. So a good chance to explore that uh, fun and fabulous city. Uh, also calls on Roatan, Belize, and Cozumel. So really a very, very cool itinerary that. Uh, and, and, you know, there is uh, also a sailing uh, March 2nd of 2024. If you want to go in uh, 2024, this same itinerary will sail in 2024. And for that particular sailing uh, with with uh, a balcony stateroom, with a beverage Wi-Fi package, uh, it comes in at 5869.62. But wait, folks, that's not all. We happen to have on the March 20, March 20, March 2nd sailing 2024. We have an exclusive rate, folks. We can do this. It prices at 58.69, but we can book this for you. Balcony stateroom at 52.91. Uh, and that even has a $100 credit with it. So uh, just let you know about that one. I think that is a great deal. If you like sailing celebrity or you would like to try celebrity for the first time, this would be a fabulous itinerary, particularly for you Floridians or those of you located up in the Atlanta met metro area because Tampa is such a easy destination to get to just right across uh, the way from Orlando, of course. Now, here is a really cool cruise sailing. If you like a longer cruise, if you've ever thought about doing a transatlantic cruise, here's one for you to consider. Uh, the date on this one is uh, in April. Uh, this is actually for 2025. I know there's a similar one in, in uh, April of 2024, but folks, it's already sold out. So you can't book the 2024 sailing, but we have one. This is with MSC Cruises, uh, and this is a just a great itinerary on this one. It's going to take you... Out of Miami, you're going to stop at St. Martin, St. John's, Antigua, uh, Bridgetown, Barbados, uh, Madeira, uh, Lisbon, Valencia, Spain, Palma de Mallorca, Palermo, Naples, Italy, Livorno up there around again, the Tuscany area, Marseille. And it's going to end in Barcelona. So this is an amazing 23-night transatlantic crossing on the MSC Seaside. Again, this sails April 6, 2025. So it's not too early to book this focus. As I said, uh, I was trying to get some space on this for someone recently on the 2024. Similar sailing to this. And folks, it's sold out. So uh, if you want something like this, I just really urge you to book ahead. Balcony stateroom for two people on this 2025 cruise, 23 nights, $4,838. That is a total for two people in a balcony stateroom for a transatlantic cruise for 23 nights. Folks, it just doesn't get any better than that. And if you have any questions about MSC, happy to answer those. A lot of you may not be familiar with them. Uh, they have uh, uh, been a relatively newcomer to the Caribbean market over here. Uh, they've made great inroads. We actually, we sailed with them Oh, just a few months ago, I can't remember. I think it was February that we were on board with them. No, that was it. We it was a it was in October last year that we were on board with them, uh, and we're doing another one this year in October, giving my sister a present for her birthday. So what she's we're going to be sailing again uh, on MSC in October, just a seven night Caribbean for us. So um, then. The last um, thing I want to talk to you about tonight, and I have two different things to talk about on re with regard to this, is Ireland. 
Folks, I cannot tell you, Ireland is flying off the shelves. I have just booked and booked and booked Ireland this past year. People cannot get enough. Probably every 25% of the quote requests that are coming in are coming in to me for Ireland. People are just going. We have a group of a dozen people uh, who will be traveling uh, September 25th. That's, that has been full for a long time. We filled that group very quick. That's an exclusive group. And we have another one I'm going to talk about in a minute. But there is another one to Ireland that I wanted to, to bring up to you. Uh, this is from Authentic Vacations. They do great. They've, they've started uh, offering these small group experiences, and they are great value, a great provider. I've worked with them for many years, and they are really, really good. Uh, this is an eight night. It's called Enchanted Ireland, and it's in 2024. There are a number of dates available for this tour, but this is really the Ireland that people dream about. Uh, you'll have uh, uh, you've got, of course, your driver guide that's going to, to be with you beginning to end uh, throughout the tour, helping you and, and uh, giving you all of the points of interest, the history and context. That's what I love about escorted travel, folks. You get not only you don't just see the things, uh, you get the insights behind them, the understanding, the cultural connections, because you get the context of what you're seeing. You're not just looking out and thinking, oh, well, that's pretty cool. That's, look, isn't that beautiful? Uh, you you get an understanding as well. And, and that's what the escorted tours do. Uh, even for our self-drive uh, vacationers in Ireland, there are, are uh, places where I really recommend that they book a, a, a driver guide for a particular day, like Ring of Kerry. You really, when you do that, even if you're traveling independently, you really do need to have a local there uh, helping you with the driving. So you're free to enjoy and experience the the uh, itinerary and, and the beauty of, of that trip. But anyway, with it, with Authentic Vacations, Eight Night, twenty uh, Enchanted Ireland Revealed for 2024, you're going to have eight nights, luxury level accommodations, private airport transfers, um, eight breakfasts, five dinners, so that's 13 meals. You're going to tour the Guinness Storehouse. Everybody who goes to Dublin wants to go there, of course. Uh, you're going to have an Irish dinner show uh, with the famous Irish dancing and so forth. Book of Kells at Trinity College. Uh, in Killarney, you're going to get the John and Carn Lake Cruise. Uh, Kilbegan Distillery Tour. You've heard about that Irish whiskey. Now you're going to learn how it's distilled, how it's made, and maybe you'll get a little nip of that along the way at the end of the tour. Uh, an Irish sheepdog demonstration. And all of the admissions to these, these great Ireland attractions is all included with this trip. And this is just a wonderful, wonderful uh, escorted tour. Many dates are available. They start at 30, roughly 3,500 per person. Again, that is double occupancy. And uh, so I, I really think if you're looking for an escorted tour at a great price, very inclusive, that is it. Now I saved the best for last. 2024, we have another Dancing Moon Travel exclusive. This is our, uh, this will be our fourth Dancing Moon exclusive Ireland tour, complete with our own uh, character who lives in Dublin, Kevin Gregg, who's been with us for since 2010, for many, many years now. He, he His sense of humor is legendary, folks, and he'll be along on this tour as he has been on all of the other but this is everything is handpicked by Kevin and, and me. This is a, a customized itinerary.
didn't mean to push that, but that's a little taste of, of the Ireland 2023 tour that that, that uh, we did. Uh, and, and this will be a very similar. Every single thing on this tour is handpicked by Kevin and me. You will have eight days of exploring Ireland. This, this, uh, this actually departs September 21st uh, through 29th of 2024. Uh, eight day tour. You're going to explore Ireland deluxe uh, luxury accommodations. Every, every single hotel has been handpicked by Kevin and me. Um, you're going to have your, your transfers. We'll have, uh, we'll have a maximum of 13 people on this tour. Uh, we'll, we'll have an oversized van that accommodates more people so you're not scrunched in. Private, show, private chauffeur guide, of course, all the way. All the taxes, fees, the chauffeur gratuity is all included. And 48-hour uh, pass on all of these. Every day you'll get breakfast at the hotel. Lovely breakfast at each of these hotels. Uh, the Dublin Hop-On Hop-Off Bus Tour, Book of Kells at Trinity College, Guinness Storehouse, Kilkenny Castle, Rock of Castle, Powers Court House and Gardens, Cliffs of Moore, Kilbegan Whiskey Distri Distillery, Muckrell's House and Gardens, uh, the Mary Plowboys Show, and a five-course meal at the Pig's Ear, which is a, an award-winning restaurant there in Dublin. Uh, accommodations, we have uh, the Brook Lodge, uh, the Imperial Hotel, the International Hotel, uh, Old Grounds Hotel, and the Davenport uh, Hotel, all of these, and the Mont Hotel. All of these are hand-picked four-star luxury hotels that you just can't believe. I'm going to play that clip now. This I meant... just a taste of what last year's tour looked like. It's just fabulous. And folks, uh, that that is going to start at um, 45, 25 per person. Double, again, that's double occupancy. We would love, we have exactly one room left. We're sold out completely on that tour with just one room left. One uh, must be double occupancy. All of our solo space is gone. So if you are interested in Ireland, folks, it doesn't get any better than that. And if you want to reach out, uh, just reach out to me. There's my information, pat at dancingmoontravel.com. Give me a call at 404-735-5774. Uh, if you're interested in any of these these tours or anything else for that matter, we we can help you with most any travel dream that you have. Now, as those of you who are regulars on on this know, we are always going to give away something special for our live listeners only. Only if you're listening live this evening, uh, I want you to just enter in Pat's picks in the comments section uh, here at the end. And I'm going to give away a set of these silicone, uh, silicone uh, luggage tags. You will never have to figure out, you'll, look, you'll know, immediately know that this is your luggage when you see these uh, coming through on the airport, when you spot them uh, at the cruise terminal, wherever you're going to see these very distinctive tags and know that, hey, that's my luggage. You don't have to dig through a bunch of black bags. They are all there. So if you're interested in winning these and you're listening live this evening, just enter Pat's Picks 
in the comments section, and I'll be drawing some lucky person's name for our live listeners this evening. Thank you so much for joining us for another episode of Let's Talk Travel. Hope to see you again next week. This is Pat at Dancing Moon Travel. Bye now.